because I'm not a biased twit like the left, I like getting my news from lots of different sources, but particularly from Democrats. If you can make your case from a Democrat, I believe your argument has 10 times more value and more size. I'm John Mike Keene. We're going to dig into a Democrat news, but first, a very much a not a Democrat is George B. Hizzy's tweet. They got to bring him back here on YouTube. YouTube, come on, people. Get your head out. Breaking Democrat U.S. Senator Richard Blumenthal. Oh, said the American people are going to be shocked, astonished, and appalled when they see the truth about Trump's assassination attempt. I think the American people are going to be shocked, astonished, and blah, blah. Here's the video clip. I think the American people are going to be shocked astonished and appalled by what we will report to them about the failures by the Secret Service in this assassination attempt on the former president. That's hardcore partisan Richard Blumenthal, a Democrat, going after his own side on the FBI, Department of Homeland Security, the Secret Service security detail around Trump, you know, because he's no fan of Trump. This guy hates Trump. But I'm telling you, this gives his argument 10 times more power. He's not saying this to gain points with his side. He's tearing his own side apart. But I think they also ought to be appalled and astonished by the failure of the Department of Homeland Security to be more forthcoming, to be as candid and frank as it should be to them in terms of providing information. He's saying the DHS is not providing a, a Democrat like Richard Blumenthal. This isn't an investigation. They're being cagey. He's condemning them. And I love, I, I have nothing but respect. I have respect for this guy, guys. We have to compliment them when they get it right. And we are going to absolutely insist on the truth and the whole truth in documents and testimony as members of the United States Senate, but also as citizens. Yeah, Blumenthal, you're not going to get the truth from Department of Homeland Security. Can you imagine, like Mayorkas, uh, Department of Justice, uh, the Secret Service with all their politicized back uh, workings? He is angry at his own side for participating in a cover-up. What did you learn new today when you said they're going to be appalled? What I'm not going to go into what we have learned in specifics. I'm giving you my reaction. Uh, and we will have a report very, very soon that I think will absolutely shock the American people, or it should, about the lapses and lags in the protection that was afforded that day. Okay, so we're a little early on this story. More information will come out, and as it does, we'll report. I just want to kind of get ahead of it, but here's Josh Hawley on Jesse Waters. Jesse, what I'm learning now is that the lead advance agent that day in Pennsylvania, this is the agent that was in charge of Trump's entire trip in Pennsylvania, that this agent actually failed one or more of her training exams when she first joined the Secret Service. That's the kind of respect that someone like Biden's people gave to Trump. They hated him. They gave him the worst D student to be in charge of his entire security detail for that state on that day. I mean, the pattern that is emerging here, Jesse, from whistleblowers who've come forward to me now over and over again is that the Trump rally was undermanned. It was understaffed. They did not have people who had experience on it. And, and now this advance agent, I'm told, uh, may have failed one or more for training exams and was known not to be a top quality agent. I mean, this is absurd. They gave these, uh, this is a diversity hire, or this is like the lowest D student in your class being put in charge of one of the, the, the most wanted target in the world is Donald Trump. The most likely, the most threats against him. He should have top security detail. And the fact that the director will not level with the American people about what's going on here is just totally unacceptable and unbelievable. And like all things with their director, they do a giant cover-up. This is a giant lapse, secretive. That's the Biden administration. That's this Department of Justice. That's this Department of Homeland Security. But now I want to show you this. Watch this. 
This is a video where someone caught Trump and Trump sees them and he points them out and he gives them a thumbs up and a point. He's like, he's giving them a nod, like, guys, everything's cool. I think that one was for us, guys. I wanted to leave you on that happy note. I'm John Mike Keen. Subscribe and thanks for the super chats.